besties welcome to or welcome back to my channel and welcome to vlogmas day three in today's video as you can tell by the title i'm going to be showing you everything on my 2023 christmas wish list why is that kind of a tongue twister christmas wish list okay there we go instead of making a typical list i decided to make a slideshow with everything that i'm requesting this year and we're just gonna go through everything because this can also be inspiration as what you want for um christmas and since it's still pretty early in december i'm making sure that you have enough time to order any things that you want or ask other people to get you or put on your wishes for santa so yeah before we get started don't forget to like subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you can notify every time i post a new video and when the next vlogmas video comes out and without further ado let's get into it there we go this is my 2023 wish list presented by elena this is the clothing section the first thing that i want is the offline puffer vest by airy it is in the color toasted coconut which is like a white like i I just put white in parentheses. Um, I'm getting it in either a small or medium, and the price is $54. I know that there are going to be some more discounts and prices that are going to like change, but at the time it was $54. Um, definitely make sure that you get a color that you want, because this is pretty expensive, and so you want to make sure it's the type of color that you can use in many different outfits. The next thing I want is another thing from Airy. They are the a lot the. They are the offline leggings. Um, I have leggings like these, like the crossover ones, but the difference is that the ones that I have are flared at the bottom. I want just like regular crossover leggings. Like I like my flares, but I think sometimes like they mess with the shoes that I try to decide or like sometimes I trip on them. So I think some non flared ones would be good. Another thing that I like about these pants is that you can get them in any size, but you can also get them in long version, which is great because sometimes, like I have pretty long legs, so sometimes I have to up the size that I get to fit for the length of my legs, but you can just order the longer version, which is amazing. The next clothing item that I'm requesting is from American Eagle. They are the AE Curvy Super High Waisted Baggy Wide Leg Cargo Jeans. I don't know what is up with these long names, but I have really been wanting some cargo pants and I wanted them in blue. I think blue would be a great color or black and then I can put any shirt with it. And I think these are the type of pants you can wear in the fall, the winter, or the summer, which is great. Next is another pair of airy crossover pants, but these are shorts. And I'm getting them in the color solar pink, or I'm requesting them in the color solar pink. The next thing is like literally the same thing, except they're from Amazon. And the reason that I'm also requesting these is because if you can, like you can see in the picture, it comes with pockets. So the ones from Airy are just more cute. They're pink, but these are black and they do have a pocket, which is great for running because I do like to run. It's great to like keep my phone right there. I can change the music easily. It's great. Another clothing item I have is this waffle oversized t-shirt. Um, it's not like on the top of my list. I just want some more like clothing pieces to go with like all the pants that I'm ordering and I think this would be really cute. And I also requested this shirt from Target. So these like past three items are more like inspiration, not exactly this. Like this, I, I just want some like t-shirts that are like kind of more v-necked um, just to fit like, cause I feel like all my shirts are about the same cut. So I just want like some more fun cut shirts. I also know there's like square top shirts are pretty popular now. So you could also request some of those. And the next thing that I'm requesting is this Pure Vita, which is like online um, engravable bar necklace. You can kind of see it in the picture, it's a little bit faint, but I want to customize it to have a cross on it. I want it in gold, and the price is only about $30. And I heard that Pure Vita is pretty good quality, so um, $30 for something good quality I think is a great price, because usually like if you want something that's good quality, you have to pay a lot more. Obviously this is not like a, an expensive necklace that's going to last you a lifetime, but I think it's going to last me a pretty good amount of time. You can also customize it to have a volleyball, a beach wave, a turtle, like almost everything. Um, anything that you want, you can. And you can also make it have words if you want your name or someone else's name. The next thing that I'm asking for are the Clifton 8 running shoes from the brand Hoka. If you guys are pop if you guys have been watching um, running TikTok, which is like pretty popular, everyone has been recommending these Hoka shoes for running apparently because like, they have really good soles. And if you look up like runner recommendations, like if you're a sprinter, there's a specific shoe that you should get. If you're like a long runner, like 14 miles or specific shoes. Uh, I'm not like a long runner, but I'm not really a sprinter either. I'll do like one or two miles ish. So that was the shoe that has been most recommended. You definitely have to do research when you're ordering running shoes because these things are pretty expensive. So you want to make sure that you're getting something that you actually enjoy. I'm also getting them in the color Summer Song slash Ice Flow. The next shoe thing that I want are from UGG. These are the Women's Classic Ultra Mini. They also have these like Tasman slipper Uggs and like high Uggs or like medium Uggs. These are a little lower than the medium Uggs and I think it's like the perfect length for me. Right now I have high Uggs that go like a little bit below my knee but I want some low ones as well. They're in the color chestnut. Now for the next section, technology. As you guys know, I'm a YouTuber. Technology is a huge part of my life. First thing I want are more um, Instax 
papers to put in my Polaroid camera because I want to take more pictures but I have no paper. The next thing I want is a MacBook cover. My MacBook is actually right here. I have this pink cover which is actually my sister's because she has two but um, I want this flower one. I think it's really cute and it'll go well with like the color of my MacBook which is like the gray color. It's about $22. You can go to like actual case websites and a lot of them have them like case to buy but Amazon also works pretty well for me. The next thing I want is another case, except it's a phone case, which is also on Amazon. You can go on any phone case website, but um, I just want this pink case. I like how the outline of the phone is a darker shade of pink than the inside of the phone. I think it's really cute. The next thing I want are Beats, Power Beats Pro. These are $250, and my favorite part about these is that they wrap around the ear, which is great for running. Um, I know like sometimes people use AirPods and they fall out, or you use like wired headphones and you have to carry your phone so that it doesn't pull out and it it's a mess and right now I have like beats but they're like headphones and they work well they don't slip off but they're pretty heavy and I like that these are pretty lightweight and they won't hold me back in running at all because if you're timing your runs those few seconds make a big difference next thing I want are more camera batteries for my camera specifically because um, these batteries do die like I don't want to say pretty fast but you know they die and I hate sometimes when I'm in the middle of filming a video I have to wait for it to charge all the way up and then continue my video instead of just switching it out, putting one in, charging the next one and just like going through a rotation. Next thing are vinyls from some of your favorite artists. You could get the love, um, I'm requesting the Taylor Swift Lover or Red Vinyl, Taylor's version obviously. Um, there's no specific price, you can get them literally anywhere. I also want the Frank Ocean Channel Orange Vinyl, this is like my favorite Frank Ocean album. <laughs> You can also get like any other one. Once again, I want this as a vinyl, no specific price. And now we are into the beauty category. I want the Elf Glow Re Reviver Lip Oil from Target. This is about $8. I'm pretty sure this is like a kind of like a dupe for the Dior Lip Oil. Don't qu quote me on that. It could just be a different thing, but I know some people say that they use it in replacement for the Dior one. But I'm not really trying to replace anything. I just think the lip oil seems good, so I want to request it. It's about $8 from Target. Another thing from Target, I need some more makeup remover. And so I know they also have like really big bottles, really small bottles. Um, people have been saying that the micellar cleansing water is better than the makeup wipes. I'm hearing some kind of mixed signals, but I've been using the makeup wipes recently and they run out really fast. And I hate especially like if they get a little bit dry and obviously this wouldn't happen with the micellar cleansing water. Next thing that I want are these Amazon Airless Pump Jars. So if you guys are popular, if you guys have been seeing these like skincare TikToks, people like this popular drunk elephant brand for skincare and they have these little pump bottles. Um, the thing though is that I can't ask for Drunk Elephant because my skin is pretty sensitive but I do think that the bottles are great so I could request these bottles put in whatever type of lotion you want and these are $9. Next I want the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. This is the 240 milliliter one. This is lotion. Um, like this is scented lotion. Everyone has been telling me that it smells great. This has been kind of a trend for a while. I also know like some of my friends have it. I think it smells great so I think it'd be fun to like put here or like maybe we're around the neck and it smells amazing. The next thing that I'm requesting are the Tree Hop Moroccan Rose Shea Butter Body Scrub. And I decided that the Moroccan Rose may not be like the best smelling one, but it works the best on my skin and it's really relaxing. Okay, so I realized that the way I said it in this clip was like, it may not be the best smelling one, making it seem like that it smells bad. It actually, <coughs> sorry, it actually smells really, really good. Like it has like a really nice scent, but in just saying that there's some other ones that do smell better because it's like more like scented but i'm saying that it tends to be the scrubs that are the least scented that are actually the best for your skin so that's what i was trying to say next i want the, the elf lash and brow enhancing serum extra things that i have wished for like not a specific category just like random stuff i need some gum pencils a weighted hula hoop <laughs> I see like all these like gym people on TikTok who say that these are like um, really like good for like ab strength but it's also like fun to do so I just wanted to try it and yeah of course that odd item is what ends today's video like ended on a weird item and that is everything that I have wished for this year of course like when you request things on your wish list like you're not gonna obviously not gonna get all of them but it doesn't also have to be like specifically what you want people can just use it as inspiration so keep that in mind but i hope this video helped you guys today and i hope you were interested in what i'm requesting comment down below the top three things on your christmas wish list this year that is all for today's video thanks for watching bye